get scratching. So we woke up this morning, had some banana pancakes, listened to the song by Jack Johnson. Banana pancakes. And we're in the desert in the middle of nowhere. I'm pretty sure I updated everyone. It's beautiful mountains, been watching the birds fly around all morning. And now we're heading to see some cave paintings just before Catavina. So yeah, we're gonna drive along this beautiful highway that Mexico has provided for us through the desert and see some cave paintings. The next video was a very long conversation. It's here that Jolie is confessing some pretty deep thoughts. I keep making excuses for everything in my life, for how they're not affected by the things that happened in my past. And the truth and reality is, is that I had a fucked up life and it also, it shaped who I am, but it also has left me broken a bit. And there's just things there that I don't know what to do with. Or I don't know how to deal with. But I'm doing my best and I feel like I'm riding that wave at the moment. Where I'm just like, I don't really want to talk about it. But I don't necessarily want to ignore it either. Yeah, and, and obviously I can feel that and I can see that. And if you're empathetic, it's pretty hard to not get wrapped up in it. And that's the last thing I want to do, is have someone else feel pain from me. Yeah, of course. Now, we're going to go into detail in a later episode, but we did want to note that it is here, in the middle of the Baja Desert, devoid of any reception, as two best mates on an indefinite journey south that Keegan, me, ultimately decides to part ways with the van in the coming months. What's he doing, Bea? Um, <laughs> I'm looking at Joel. Mate, get your head out of the rock. My head is full of rock. Your head's in the sand, mate. It's gonna be sand one day. I got a whole head of rocks. Oh, I don't know how to say it. Materia prima. The, the, the sources that they used, the, the materials that they used. What's the best one? No, it's good. Actually, I don't want to have to keep it for painting. So you think you can stop me and spit in my eyes? That job camouflages. I'm inconspicuously, inconspicuously oh. in a rock. There's a human there. In the desert. Found a bit of an oasis in the middle of the desert. River flowing. Somewhat.
we picked up the pieces of the panels off the side of the road, the reality of our situation set in. Outwardly, I had a smile on my face, but internally, I was devastated. What happened, Joel? I cut my finger. It really hurts. Thank <laughs> you, Bobo. Ah, so I think the universe is trying to tell me something, <laughs> and it's kind of my fault. I forgot to put a bolt to secure the panels down. And we drove, well, Keegan was driving. I was hanging out with Valdebo Dentro in the green van, the safe van. <laughs> we raid their electrical box so that we can plug the van in. And now you connect to live wires, which is the most dangerous part. 